Okay, here's kind of an old one. Not sure what we'll get for a root, but you can definitely see it's an Indian cucumber, you know, in the later stages of life. So I'll put the uh, camera here. Let's see if that if I capture it. <clears throat> if not, I'll just delete it. So, go around the roots. Kind of clear as much as I can out here because it is, in the fall time, they're really fragile. Here's the leaves and the stalk. What was connected to that stalk right here is the root, the actual Indian cucumber. And boy, is it delicious. It's so, so delicious. I have a lot of them here where I live. I have heard that um, in some places they're considered endangered so if that is the case in your in your area please don't pick these just know where they are so if you ever need to you have them um, I do have an overabundance of these plants where I am and these taste just like cucumbers are so delicious so let's see if maybe we can find another one see this is a look like plant looks like it and if we dig up that root, you'll see it looks very similar, but look at these leaves. The veins don't run north and south. They run side to side. And let's go ahead and uh, dig this up. Let's see what it looks like. It's going to look similar. So you can see it does look similar, it still has that root, but it's not really like, I don't know, it's still just part of the plant, it's not like a tuber. You can easily tell that apart, and I don't think this is a star plant, I'm not sure what plant this is. I thought the star plant was the only one that looked similar to it, but apparently you know, there's, this plant does as, as well. What a delicious trail nibble. Tastes just like cucumber, it's so good. Extremely delicious.